Hey guys, so we have new updates in the world of Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. Some new ones, but I'm not going to make this a big video, so let's just get straight into it, which shows off some more images of Goku in his uh, Yard Drag costume and even another image of Mass Complete Ultra Instant Goku. So let's take a look. So yeah, these images were courtesy of Just Play It and a channel called Maru Haki. So that channel apparently had a close-up image of Complete Ultra Instinct Goku, which isn't much, but hey, it's always good. I, because remember, in the original trailer that came out um, some days ago or a week ago, it only showed him like it only showed Ultra Instinct Goku's face close up, but but like now we have a better picture of it. And of course, just play IT, apparently played the game, had their thoughts. I'm not going to read through it because there's just no point. Pretty much the same old in terms of, you know, information. So let's show off the clips that they did post on their website. Obviously, that's just the was it the title screen and then the, you know, them showing off some of the stages. And yeah, obviously, you hear the music looks pretty good. Um, nothing much we haven't already seen already. Now, uh, let's look at what the Cell Games Arena that Bandai Namco posted today. Apparently, Broly's grab has also been updated. Let's take a look at the before and after, with the before being on Supreme Kai's planet. Yeah, I would say there's improvement. Looks better to me. Just like how what just like in the original movie, um, I'm guessing they're just const they're just gonna be constantly uh what updating these, showing off more updates of these skills, whatever, man. Let's uh, I just want to wrap this video up. Information: Gohan's grab that he used in that Cell Saga trailer is in fact a unique throw at two Cell, and not just a gen and not really a generic one. So obviously, let's take a look at this. That's where he grabbed me. That's where he grabbed me. Amazing grab. I did not expect that's where he grabbed me. That's where he grabbed me. Amazing grab. I did not expect that. And then of course let's look at the original one that's apparently generic. Great. I love it when um I see these in demo showcases. Oh let's see, what else? I know what else. We have a clip of uh, Super Saiyan Blue Evolved Vegeta, and he can be in his uh, Blue Evolved form a lot more. So let's uh, take a look at this as well.
Yeah, as you can tell, it not only takes like five blast stocks now, but it actually lasts a pretty good while. I believe on Twitter they said it was like a minute now. And obviously that's a good thing. You know, um, a lot of people were very disappointed that Super Saiyan Blue Evolved Vegeta wasn't a separate form. Although I guess it makes sense if it's similar to like Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken. But you know what? It's also a good thing that now it lasts longer and now you get to play more as a Super Saiyan Blue Evolved Vegeta instead of like losing the form instantly. But yeah, that's it for now. Um, Just some very quick updates. Did not want to waste time here. Be sure to give this video a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys next time. Weaklings will always be weak. <laughs> Put you out of your misery. Take this! And by the way, Edukaba apparently posted a new raw gameplay clip of boot tanks. So let's take a look. And now that's pretty much it. So I guess really the question remains, you know, um, when is the Boo Saga trailer going to come and what's going to happen from here on out? The way I see it, Bandai Namco has kind of been inconsistent when it comes to their updates. It's like one day we'll have an official 30 minute second clip. Next minute we'll have a commercial. The way I see it, it's a, like at first I thought that we would be getting like gameplay clips from Bandai Namco Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays. Then they stopped that pattern and now it's apparently been daily and then maybe a day is going to get skipped. But obviously, one thing that remains to be seen is the Boo Saga trailer. And honestly, I would say early September. I don't expect it to be announced tomorrow, but uh, early September seems in the realm of possibility. The only thing I'm concerned about is the fact that the Boo Saga trailer might just be one of the most pointless trailers that we have gotten yet. And it's because all of these characters have already been shown in official demo gameplay footage, which takes away the point from their trailers. It's like what you're going to put in some cool music and some interactions and you think that is going to be a good trailer. Huh? No, what you guys need to do is if you're going to spoil all of those characters in the demo, then put new characters shown in the actual trailer. Put Kid Goku, put OG Dragon Ball, do something, show off something new, maybe show off the customization, do something because we just you just going off on character trailers and you already have them showcased in the demo anyway. It's like, what the hell, man? All right, whatever. Um, that pretty much concludes this video. A lot longer than I thought it would be, so I'll put timestamps in the description. Be sure to give this video a like, subscribe if you're new. I'll put credits in the description. If I forget to credit you, let me know, and I'll edit the description. And yeah, take care.